Hello everybody and welcome back to the Binding of Isaac After Beth Plus and in today's episode we are going to be going fast, fast, fast. As fast as you can damn go. I'm going to pick something that's a quick challenge because, oh no, this is not a quick challenge. Oh no. Uh, because I am doing something that is both incredibly risky and very dumb. Um, <laughs> uh, so, I have decided that it would behoove me, uh, be a good idea, to put my tea on, put my, put my food in the oven. Tea is moving in a spiral, now thank you. Put my food on in the oven, uh, and then do a video while I wait for it to cook. So, that, this, is, this is bad for a number of reasons. One, if the video extends any longer than around 30 minutes, there's a, there's a chance my house might bed down, uh, so that's not great. Uh, two, it means I have to kind of speed through the video, so I've had to pick a challenge that's traditionally a little bit faster than normal. Um, and we're going to have to be playing with our guppy's hairball real well here, and so far it's going well. Uh, yeah, and yeah, it's just, it's just all round... All around, I'm going to say it's a bad idea. Don't do it, kids. It's it's terrible. But the reasoning behind it, you may think, tell, why even try? Why even be so dumb? But there's there's actually a little bit of logic behind this. Albeit not much, but there is a little bit of logic behind this. So, the reasoning is, the video that you're currently watching right now, this video, the aforementioned video, um... It's, uh, it is going out in around an hour, and I forgot to record it until right now, because I'm dumb. And, uh, <laughs> I realise that I need to do a video, but I'm also kind of hungry. But I'm not super hungry. So I was like, I could do, I could do to eat before, then do the video, but then I might not have enough time. So what I'll do is, I'll mix the both, and cut the waiting time in half, because I've also got to do the Bumbo video that also goes out later. Come on, dude. You're, wa you're wasting everyone's time here. Stop. <laughs> oh, my God. This dude. Look at this dude. Oh, my God, thank you. Um, Yeah, so I'm doing the, the riskiest of plays. The I'm going to try and beat a run in under 30 minutes, otherwise my house may burn down run. Let's let's try it out, shall we? That's really good. Let's see how it goes. Actually, I don't think that helps us at all. I think we have to have the item for it to affect it. But yeah, so it's gonna be it's gonna be a wild ride, but we'll see how it goes. I do like this challenge, by the way. If you're if you're wondering, I didn't just pick this one because it's quick. I did pick this one because it's also fun, and we do need to do it. So, well, look at that! Wah 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 wah! I'm like absolutely speeding through it already. Um, I would take that, but I, I don't think I can. Uh, 99 coins, damage up, look down. After clearing six rooms, it's five coins will be removed. I think we have to take that because it gives us deal the devil president and it also gives us access to the shop. I'm going to go back over here to the shop and it's going to make buying things from the shop really, 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 really good. Really, really good. Ah. Let's have a look, see. So we'll buy that. Then we'll reroll. Then we'll buy that, and then we'll re-roll, and then we'll keep re-rolling, and then we'll keep re-rolling, and then we'll, what the hell does this do? Loot magnet? No, it's an active. I don't want it. Champion belt, um, actually is a terrible item, I just realised. Oh no, it increased our fly damage, it increased our fly damage. It's not as bad as I thought. Uh, the lighter, unfortunately, is an active. I can't really take actives. And restock, which we will take, uh, just in case, just for later on. Um, projectile protection. I don't know what that does, uh, but we'll give it a go. Either way, we're on our way, we're on our way. And we've got something good going on here. I'm, I'm happy about this. Let's keep speeding. And we can get some really good restock stuff going on a little bit later on if we get some more money. Although we are going to be losing coins every six rooms. So we're not going to be able to keep too much money up. It was kind of more of a all or one sort of, all or nothing sort of thing. All or one. What am I about? Gotcha. But using our active item is going to trigger our... Uh, our little potato boy thing. So I'm going to make sure to use it within the room I mean, it's going to deal decent damage, as you can see there. Just lost some money there, look. Uh, but we also get the flies and the extra damage, and it's, it's it's all good, my G. It's all good. But the actual little battery ball, I think it scales the damage, and it's also just pretty strong anyways. Very hard to aim, though. I don't even know if you can aim it. We'll open that up, just because why not? Give me that penny, boy. Give me that penny. It's running away from me. But as you can tell... I am in full-on speed mode. You, you may not see. This is a rare version of Turtle. Rare speedy boy. But needs must. It has to be done. Um, a six to re-roll. I, that would allow me to shoot. But honestly, even though I'm in a rush, I am not in a position to be re-rolling considering how decent our, uh, our run is right now. I, I don't think that's a good idea. 
let's get into our shop here. What you got for us, I will take that. It gives us something. And we can also get some refreshes here. Uh, fire extinguisher. I mean, I'm going to do it just because it's going to let us buy something else. Um, mm, that was kind of a bad idea, maybe. Let's buy two of these then. And then keep on heading on. Oh my god. Okay, this this is a this is a bad room. Let me swing this at you. So so now we have broken stopwatch plus um what's the other one we have? Uh, plus the the torch thing. So we're gonna have a decent amount of chance to slow things down. Ah, I used my I used my uh, space bar at the wrong time there. Darn tootin'. Didn't mean to. Well, as you can see, this is actually like a really really good item. The, the guppy's hairball. It's really hard to use in regular runs, but it's still very good. Um. Obviously, our money's going to stay, be staying at zero unless we get quite a big amount of money here, so I'm not too bothered about that. Ah, my god. He's a bomb. Got one of them. Ah, my god, I'm getting hit so much. No! You bastard! Do it. Bomb him. How is he not dead? Oh my god. And we got the sister heart shooter thingy. That's not bad. It fires off shots. I think it fires more shots when we're at lower HP or something like that. It's decent. I'm 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 all, I'm all for it. Oh god, we got a speed up room here. Don't too, don't want too many of those. Don't want too many of those. Ooh, I will take that. Thank you for the keys. Thank you for the keys. Getting the like flight and everything. I wonder if then um, the shots from the little heart sister thing will give us flies. If it does, then we're in for some we're in for some real good stuff. Going for some real good stuff. So basically, all we need to do on these rooms is build up the size of our uh, Guppy's hairball. Rooms that are slowed down and easy, just build up Guppy's hairball size. Every hit is going to build it up more and more. So we want to be getting that as high as possible. These enemies are going to be a real pain in the ass. Luckily, we caught him on the uh, fly down there. And there you go. I will take that. Thank you. There's a chest in here, apparently. I think I got it as a room reward. Thank you, thank you. Uh, we want all the money we can get just in case we get to a shop before it takes it all away. The evil game. Yeah, that, that heart thing's doing a decent job here. Makes a kind of annoying noise, but <laughs> we'll deal with it. We'll, we'll be fine. Right, so this guy should be really easy for us, especially considering he's only spawning stuff. Okay, the, the heart thing does spawn flies when it hits enemies. That is a massive get for us right now. That's an absolutely massive get for us. Every time that, that heart thing hits, we're dealing fly damage. And we need that to live. Cat and nine tails, even more fly damage is what I like to see. Unfortunately, health is a little bit on the weak side right now. A little bit on the uh, on the really, really weak side. Um, but we'll be okay. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to have to do this, aren't I? Too much, too much chance for good stuff. Too much chance for good stuff. And it's a good chance to... Level up our ball. I like leveling up my ball. Oh, the fact that that spawns flies is an absolute godsend. My god. Whoa, 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 whoa. That's a new enemy, and I love it. I absolutely love it. Got you with a hairball. What do you think of that? Yeah, I think we have Guppy's tail. Yeah, that's why we're getting so many chests. We're getting an insane amount of chests here. Damn, I missed him. Where are you coming up? Yes. Nice one, fly. Uh, changes your stats each time you get hit. We don't want that. We could get some really bad damage, and our damage is actually very, very good right now. Doesn't actually matter which way we look when we're holding fire, so... It just depends on where we place this thing, because this thing stops. Oh, God, these things are so annoying. Oh, my God. It's... Why can't it shoot over gaps? Stop it. Come on now. There you go, got him. The fact that that thing can't shoot over gaps is terrible, and also we went all the wrong ways, which is just great, isn't it? Oh damn, I thought that guy was going to blow up then, but luckily, he just dropped a bomb. Nothing too major. Give me that penny. Give me that penny. Wow, batteries for days. Give me that battery. I think this is the room we're going to lose some money. Yep, it is. Sad times. That's really evil, that. Like, it's a really cool deal of Everlight in there. You get a lot of money now, but for the rest of the run, you're going to be really struggling unless you're getting a lot. And a lot of the times, you, you don't really get that much. Getting a shop here, though, is very nice. Oh, it's not a shop. It's a greed fight. 
cool. Cool. What a time to be alive. IV bag is not very useful for us. Keep going. Keep her moving. And Eternal Heart is lovely. Although, I think we're on the last floor. If we are, that's pretty good timing. That's pretty good speedy timing right here. Ah! My god. Yeah, we're actually speeding through this. This is... Uh, maybe I went too fast. Maybe I went too quick. Maybe I was too, too much of a speedy turtle right now. Oh my god. Right, let's see how many this can take out. Oh my god. That, that laser beam thing is just the best thing ever. It just takes out, like, every single problem that could ever exist. It's so good. Um, give me you. Cork. I don't care. Increases the radius of the creep. Who cares about that? Oh shit. That guy got me. I'm gonna have to rely on flies. Do it, flies. Do it for me. Thank you. This little asshole. He, like, he's invincible unless he actually fully pops out the ground as well. That's the most annoying thing. A black heart there is absolutely crucial. Okay, we do have one more floor. I thought we did. I wasn't 100% sure, but I was kind of sure. Guppy's hairball is also blocking shots here, which is really, really nice. Oh, yes. Mr. Dolly is amazing. A little bit more HP. And we do have nine lives here, which I will take just in case. Um, because I want to take the other thing anyways, because doesn't this one with the darkness? So, apparently, apparently, let's, let's, I'm going to pick it up anyways, because we're going to be losing the HP either way. But apparently, I may have broken Ipecac mod by accident, so this shouldn't say, yeah, it didn't change our stats at all. It's meant to give us double damage. I don't know why the items from Ipecac aren't working correctly right now. They should be. I don't really know what's going on with that. Um, so... We may have to look into um, exactly why that's not working as intended for right now. I'll, I'll have to maybe reset the mod. and Because I, I basically, when I down download the mod, I do delete a few of the files. Uh, just because there's a few things in the mod that, although I love the mod as a whole, there's a few things that I uh, personally don't like to play with. Like there's a sort of meter that, that fills up for uh, like blessings and stuff. This is just horrendous. Thank you. Uh, like for like blessings and, and curses and things like that. And... Personally, I, I, I'm not a big fan of it in terms of like the UI and stuff, so I just get rid of that. Like, I'd love it as if it was just a background system without any UI. I'd be fine with it. I don't actually know what the system does as, it, as itself. I'm not sure if it's fully implemented yet. But, yeah, I might have to re-implement re that and just see if it's any better. Because it's not something I hate. I do I do like the idea. It's just, um, I, I kind of like my Isaac to look as vanilla as possible, even when it's modded sort of thing. If you, I don't know if a, lot of, if a lot of you kind of know what I'm talking about here, but sometimes when you mod games, like Skyrim, for example, you, you like to... Oh my god, it's a rainbow heart. I don't know what that does, but it looks amazing. Um, but sometimes you, you want to keep the game still feeling like the vanilla game, just with additions and extras and sort of fixes and stuff. And that's kind of what I've gone for. But obviously... Some things in certain mods, especially when they're bundled up, may not fit that theme that you want. And so that can be a little bit of a problem sometimes, and you have to get in, get your hands dirty, and, uh... Oh, wait, 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 wait. If this works properly, this would be amazing. If, if this if this gives... Oh, it does. It gives this thing homing shots. That's so good for us. That's so good for us. Stack this thing up. Having, having this thing have homing shots is... Probably one of the most brilliant things ever for us right now. Because we're going to be hitting so many shots and getting so many flies. Right, what do you got for us? Game kid. Don't really care. I will buy a soul heart though, just in case. But yeah, this is, this is kind of beautiful. And in we go. Onto the heartiest, and it's a slow down fight as well. You couldn't have asked for a better setting, really, could you? So, do you actually have to pick up the trophy to get the to get the win on these? Because I kind of want to do boss rush, just just to just to have to do it, sort of thing. Should we check what's in boss rush? Um. Ah, fuck it. Why not? It's a bit of a meme, isn't it? It's a bit of a meme. It's a bit of a meme. Let's give it a go. Let's give it a go. 
cat's got my tongue. My food's not going to be ready for another 10 minutes yet, so... Even longer. 15 minutes. I might as well. Oh my god, we can't... We can't hit this bloody cycle thingy. Come on, dude. Stop. This is torture. We got it. We got it. Right, good, good. As long as we've got Herming on these shots, we should be fine for the most part. It just means some boss is going to be a little slower. Ones that we can't hit with our uh, swing are going to be a little slower. Or ones that isn't more dangerous to hit with our swing, at least. The good thing is, as well, we do have nine lives. If we die and get spawned outside of the room, we can just give up and um, keep going, sort of thing, and just, like, finish the challenge. Shit, I got hit. kind of forgot we had a uh, fanny pack. Oh my god, Monstro, he's incoming. Oh, Monstro jumped. Them enemies have just jumped right on top of my dude there. That's perfect, thank you. Exactly, exactly what I was looking for you to do. Oh my god, that was bad. I just walked right into him. Good, he's dead. Where are you, war? War. What is it good for? Absolutely nothing. Oh my god, he's going to be a right pain if he keeps doing this. Just keep swinging the ball. Keep swinging that ball around. Okay, good. He's down. He's done for. Oh my god, look at the damage we're dealing. This is a much harder enemy for us. We've got to remember we've got our bombs. We can use those. Okay, he's, he's laid down a red poop in a really awkward position, so we're going to have to watch out for that. Yeah, let's use that pyro bombs. A lot more frivolously here. Okay, that was a bad bomb. Bad bomb placement. He's he's kind of running around like a lunatic here. We're gonna have to stop him with a bomb. Didn't work. This is gonna be really difficult. He did run into spikes there, so he can hurt himself on the spikes. So it's not gonna take as long as I thought, but it's still gonna be a while. It's still gonna be a real tedious bit of shit. Oh my god, it's gonna be hor horrendous. Oh my god, he almost hit me as well. Dude, you need to stop. Right, I'm just gonna place this here and hope he hits it. Nope. Okay, just take out all the rocks at this point. No! God damn it, I need to preemptively strike. I did hit him there, on the swing. Yes, we got him, finally. Torch is over. We've just got to be ready for that red poop and, like, aware it's there. So that's going to be a real pain if we if we don't keep an eye on it. No, thank you, laser beam boy. Right, so I think we should try and preemptively bomb the uh, spawn locations of a lot of these enemies. Yeah, stay out of the way of that. I need to get my guy. Hey, look at him. He's not even on me and he, he did damage there. There's another enemy underground somewhere. It's frail. He's a pain in the ass. Or he can be at least. Depends on where he pops up. Yeah, he's going to be a pain in the ass. Okay, we got him. We got him. Okay. This enemy shouldn't be too... Oh, okay, actually this enemy going to be awful. I was like, this enemy shouldn't be too bad because it splits up, but then it split up into me. Made me realise that life is a lie. Okay. Go, little heart thing. Oh my god. The poop boy. Ah, the poop boy's gonna get me. Don't do it, poop boy. Come over here, you little snake. Good, good, good. Okay, this guy needs to die real quick, thank you. Okay, this guy needs to die real quick too. He's getting way too close to me, I don't like it. Ow, how did that hit me? I don't think so, sir. Okay, good. Get tased by my ball. It's inside him. It's inside him. We got him. 
Oh god, this guy's gonna be a pain. What I need to do is move past people and push my ball like into their vicinity so that they just keep getting hit by it. If anything jumps onto me, make sure I just get my heart really close to it. It's a really effective way of doing it, actually. Anything that jumps, I can just do that look and it jumps directly onto my heart. It gives me a ton of flies back. There you go. Ah, ha, 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 ha. We found a way now. We found a way now. How are you not dead yet, though? Like, dude, how much health do you actually have? There we go, he's dead. Wow. Oh my god, it's the worst guy ever. This guy's gonna be a real pain. I kind of need him to jump onto me here to kill him. There you go. Just so I can get the flies going like this look. Wow, that was good. That was good. Ah, my god. We have to kill the mask as well over here, don't we? Okay, good. We got a bomb stuck on the mask. This is not good. Damn, let's do that. He should, should stop right on it. There you go, we got them. Is the mask still alive? No. We did it! Yay! How do we escape? If I could escape... Ah, do 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 My house isn't gonna burn down. Hey hey hey! That was a crazy run. That was crazy fun, and it was crazy quick. I hope you guys enjoyed, and thank God I'm not dead in real life because of the fire. See you later.